If you guys love it, what's the Back with another video. And today I am really excited because I am going to be doing a review on ColourPop makeup. So, I already opened the box because I figured you guys wouldn't want to watch me open a box. Yeah, so another I figured one. that was going to be a little boring. Sorry, if you guys hear my husband in the background, he's just being extra. Don't mind him. Um, I'm just saying, you just did a unravel. Bought a little bit. Yeah. I just so bought funny. a couple of things. Um, a couple and, of things. Right. and if you guys hear the TV in the background, I'm going to try and drown it out with the music, so hopefully you guys won't hear it. Um, but yeah. So I'm just going to, I ended up getting everything for a little over 300 but, but, before I yeah. even say anything, Dang. before I even say anything, okay, let me just make it very clear, I did not spend $300 at one time. The, the, wonderful, the wonderful thing about ColourPop is they have a payment plan called Afterpay. It has four different installments. You can... Do a payment plan on something as low as twenty-five dollars. So I think the highest they let you go is a thousand dollars. So that is amazing. That's awesome. So with that, that helped a lot because obviously if that wasn't gonna happen, your girl was not gonna pay three hundred dollars of her own money. And that's another thing. I am not sponsored in any way, shape, or fashion by ColourPop. I am doing this on my own free will. Alright, with that being said, you guys, let's go ahead and see if you guys can see it. This is a collaboration from Karuchi and Color and Colourpop. This is called the Brown Shadow um, Colourpop Eyeshadow Palette. I'm also going to, with each item, I'm going to also put up a picture of what it looks like on the website. Um, uh, it shows which... Uh, shades it has. So it has chai, jamocha, amber, ginger, auburn, saute, sorrel, henna, henna, and chalk. I might have pronounced, mispronounced all of those, but we're not going to talk about that. Alright, so I'm going to open it. And that is the palette. Automatically, you know, I really do like this. This is a really cute palette. I can see myself using this um, a lot and it does come with a mirror I believe all of them do come with a mirror which is awesome yeah, that's great so let's go ahead and move to the next palette okay the next palette is lit um, and this one is a collaboration between Bretman Rock and ColourPop Again, I will have the picture and the price on somewhere on the screen next to this so that you guys can see how much this is. Um, I automatically, I love this color. Like, like she is giving me everything right now. The shades for this palette is Or Whatever, Mercy, Macchiato, Cleo Amor, She Got Money, Period, Like, and Buddy. So... I have to zoom in as well, but this is like really cute. It's like it says lit and it's in glitter. Oh, you guys, this is cute. And then like I'm not a big fan of yellow, but I will I'll make that yellow work. Like you guys see that? This is, this is really cute. I like this one too. Um, okay. So let's move on to the next one. Okay, so the next one is called Blue Moon. This one is Lummy, <laughs> The Body, Moonlight, Starry Eyed, Billy Jean, Tide Pool, Mad About You, Fine China, and Clued In. Like I told you guys in my past videos, I'm trying to get more into makeup. Oh, this is cute. This is really cute. I like this. These definitely look better in person than they do on the pictures. 
Um, I feel like the pictures online don't really do them justice. I feel like these look a lot better um, when you get them. Which is a good thing. I'd rather them look better in person than to look really bad in person. Then I'm like, okay, what did you guys take a picture of? <laughs> Okay, so this one is called Main Squeeze. Okay. This one is called Main Squeeze. This one is more of like um, like the reddish, pinkish type uh, shades. We have Froze, which is like F-R-O-S-E. -O Juicy Fruit, Home Slice, Like It's Hot, Marchino, Big Gulp, Seed Money, Baywatch, and Red Bottom. Ooh. I know I said like reddish pink, but they're not really reddish pink. They're more like um, like the red and dark red undertones. So it's more of like dark colors. So if you if you did want something pink, like yeah, no, I was gonna say I thought I saw some pinks in it, but not really. Um, if you did want something pink, you know, then you probably shouldn't get this one just because there there really aren't any pink-ish undertones or pink tones in the middle. And my last palette is Misunderstood. It is a collaboration between ColourPop and Disney. Um, I believe this is when they did like a collaboration with like um, Disney villains. So like Maleficent, Ursula, and all those wonderful people. Um, so this one is No Spots, Mon Grills, I'm probably, and again, I am so sorry if I'm mispronouncing these words, Diablo, Devious, Tragic, Underworld, Pain and Panic, Forest of Thorns, Flop Sam, The Fates, Revenge, Sing, Jet Sam, Facial, and 101. I like this. This is nice. Okay, so let's look into this. So this is the only palette Hmm. This is the only palette that does not come with the mirror in this palette because it's a special. And I'm going to try and zoom in and see if you guys can see it. But what I don't like is like as soon as you open it, a little bit of the eyeshadow is in different ones. So like, I'm not sure how that happened. I'm not sure if that's just, it could just be something that happened right now as I was opening it. But it's not really a good first look or first impression. Not really sure if it's just dirt or like this. Yeah, see, it comes right off, but you shouldn't shouldn't really want that. Um, so yeah, just wiping it off seems better. But uh, and then I do like the holograph look it has in the camera. I think that's cute. Uh, but these are the shades for that. I did order the primer set uh, duo so it comes with a primer and it comes with a face setting spray so like I told you guys before I'm just now getting into the whole makeup so I've never used primer before instead of like the only primer I've used um, as of recent is Mary Kay so I just decided I was like so if I'm using primer I might as well get more primer so this is the primer that it looks like right now, and this is the face setting spray. Um, I might do a separate video. Well, I know I'm actually I know I'm gonna do a separate video where I do an entire face of ColourPop. So I'll be just starting from head to toe, just a whole face of ColourPop. So I'm um, using the stuff that are in this box, and so when I do that, then I'll be using these. Um, Moving right along. So the next thing we have is the concealer. And I just got it from the same skin tone. 
same with the foundation. The foundation. The mascara. So, alright, funny story. Story time, really short story about the mascara. When I was on ColourPop, I saw so many different, you know, colors, and I always just get random, like, just black mascara. I don't get color mascara. But, you know, it's like, hey, go big or go home, right? So I decided to get different colors mascaras. Now, the ones I thought I had ordered were black, red, green, and blue. I just picked random colors and was like, I'm just going to try it. It looks horrible. I will sell it to someone else, give it to someone else. Somebody will wear it. Um, but if not, then I'll wear it. So, it wasn't, <laughs> it wasn't until I got the package today and I was going over the inventory that I realized, hey, we have three black mascaras. Yep. So, three of these are black. So these three right here, these are all just black mascaras. And then I just got one red and one blue mascara. Yep. Just got one. So it's like, well great, I have plenty of black mascara, so that's, that's awesome. That's perfect. Okay, and then, so that's all the mascara. Um, again, let me know if you guys want me to swap these colors, see how they look. Uh, I probably will end up doing a video anyways with the full face. So I'm trying to decide if I want to do a swapping video before the full face or after the full face. I feel like if I do it before, it will make more sense than doing it after. Um, but you guys let me know, those are my lip lipsticks. Like, literally, they're called lipsticks. So, I'm just gonna open one of them up. I'm gonna try and open the other one up without breaking it. It's gonna always mess these kind of things. I can do it right there. Okay, so it looks just like this. I'm probably gonna do a close up later on. This this cut this is a uh, this shade is called Jammy Fesh. So it looks just like this. And you just kind of slide it up. And it looks like that. Want me to swap them? Let me know. This was random. I just saw it. Um, sorry, it's a random break in the middle of the video. I uh, it's a um, yeah. collaboration between Kathleen Light and ColourPop. It's the Zodiac sign bundle, so I'm an Aquarius, so I got the Aquarius one. And I believe it's just an eyeshadow and a loose pigment. I don't know what a loose pigment is. I'm not going to tell you what I think it is because I know it's wrong. I know it has nothing to do with it. So, yes, it has nothing to do with that. And then I just got some, um, this is an eyeshadow brush. And then I got just a regular blending, small blending brush. I honestly have, have no idea why I bought those. I have makeup brushes. I have like a whole freaking kit of makeup brushes. I, I really didn't use those. Um, okay, and then these, these are gel liners. So I decided to do, oh, I got one more lipstick. Uh, I decided, same with the mascara, decided to do different colors of gel liner. Because I love, love, love wearing eyeliner. I love it. I think it makes my eyes really pop because I have big eyes. So I'm always trying to find different ways to make them pop. And I feel like eyeliner um, definitely makes that pop. And I first got introduced to eyeliner when I was in college in 2014. 
So my friend was just like, I was doing my makeup and, and she was just like, try some eyeliner and she did the little wing action and I was just like, I was, I was hooked. So I've always, always loved eyeliner, but I've never tried any other color other than black. And so I decided, I was like, you know what, get different colors. So I got Swerve, which I believe is like a red, and then I got Kicker. Which, you know what? I'm just gonna open it. I'm not gonna guess. That's what the video is for. And just like all the other products, I'm gonna have a picture of each item that I bought um, along with the one that I'm currently talking about. That way, you guys can see the price, see what it looks like, see if it's something you like, you know? Sometimes the videos don't do it justice. Okay, so yeah, this. These are the gel liners. This one was swerved, so I'm not really sure if this is the... This one looks black, so... Um, I think that one's black, but I thought it was the one that was black. I could be wrong. Okay, so I'm gonna not gonna lie. I'm not gonna lie. Uh, I don't know what that was before that, but I'm I'm not really sure if because that first one it looked black. Uh, I did a little swipe on my finger there. Okay, and this one is silver. Okay, so yeah, so that one. What it is is I went and bought like because I usually use like the marker because I feel like the marker gives me more control. Um, I feel like the pencil, I always like stick myself with it, so I can't stand using the pencil. It's like, if it's between using a pencil and no eyeliner, I just won't wear eyeliner. Because I just, it, it's very uncomfortable, and I just like, I probably just keep sticking myself in the eye with it. So, I always use a marker. So, I did get two markers. One is a silver and one is black. Um, and then I got liquid, uh, li liquid liners. So one is red, one is blue, one is green, and one is black. So I'm gonna try the liquid liners because I've never tried them before, but they have they're supposed to have more of like a more defined bolder look to them. So we're gonna we're gonna see how that works. Alright, let's get into the fun stuff, which is the lip gloss. So I went and got a crap ton of lip gloss. I got a crap ton of stuff as you guys can see over here in this pile over here. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and move this box now that everything's out of it. Um, so this one is the Liquid Lip. This is also a collaboration between Karuchi and um, ColourPop. Now, granted, I had no idea that some of these were collaborations until I looked at the packaging that shows you how much I pay attention to detail. None. Pay no attention to detail. Uh, and that's how I ended up with three black mascaras. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I'm not the smartest person in the world, guys. Sorry. Okay, so this one looks more so like a. A brown is exactly what it looks like as a brown, which is perfect because I can match it with the brown sugar um, palette that I also bought, so that works perfectly. And then we have the Ultra Matte Lip. This is the Melonade, so that probably can go with um, the main squeeze because it, it kind of looks like that, yeah. Ooh, so this is, oh, this is so pretty. So this is more so like a, um, like a, like a dark red. And I, I love, I love, I love, love, love dark colors, especially dark red because, you know, red is my favorite color. Okay, so let's see what else we got going on here. So this one is hot-headed. 
Yeah, that sounds like me. So I think this is the metallic one. I did get one, one or two metallic um, lip glosses. So yeah, this is more of the metallic lip, lip, uh, no, 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 no. lip gloss. <laughs> I cannot talk. This is what happens when you try to stay up past your bedtime doing videos. This is also a collaboration with Disney um, to go with their villains uh, set. So this is more of like a, like a goldish color in the palette color, so I'll probably wear it with that palette. I'll probably match it with that palette. Um, let's see. Okay, ooh, this one's cute. So this one is, what's this one? This one is Controla. I'm sorry, I had a little drink on you guys for a little bit. So this one, I like this one, but I have a feeling that it's going to look a little too light on me, but when I do the color swatch, um, swap, swatch, when I do the color swatch video, I'll, I'll know for sure. And I'll probably, I'll probably end up recording that one later on today, I was going to say tomorrow, but it's like 1 o'clock in the morning over here, so it is tomorrow. But um, I'll probably end up doing that one later on today that way I can just go ahead and just see which ones look good on me and see which ones don't. This one is called Splashdown. This one is like a darker purple which I like. I told you guys I like my dark color so any dark color I'm pretty much gonna like. So yeah this, this is nice. Let's see what else we got here. What else we got here. We have the Arriba. So let's see what Arriba looks like. Ooh, yes. So, I'm going to compare them. This is pretty much close. Okay. Okay, yeah, now I can see the difference. I was gonna say, I was trying to think, see if these two, not were the same, but like, were the kind of like really similar shades. And they are similar in shades, but this one is darker than this one. This one is a little bit lighter, not by much, but it, it is, if you put them close together, you can tell, okay. This is a darker red, and that one is more of like a, like a medium, medium red, um, which I still, I still love it. It's still cute. It's still really, really cute. So, I will definitely be rocking both of them. Okay, you guys, we only got three more. Sorry. We only got three more lipstick. So, this one is called Boo. Sorry if I scared you guys. I probably did. So, I'm not that scared. So, this one is I can tell I can just tell you right off the bat I probably will not be wearing this one as much just because it's it's just too light for me. Now if I'm wrong and I swatch this and it looks great, you know, um then that's great. I mean I didn't waste my money. But I'm not really getting my hopes up for that one in particular. Now this California love one, you know I had to get this California one because I'm from California. Well, I was born in California, so that counts. Um, so this one is this one is Cypress Chill. Yeah, it's a dark color. I love dark colors. Okay, so this one. I feel like this one is like a darker version of the one I just had, but I still feel like this would still look nice on me. I feel like this would definitely still look nice on me. And I know you guys are probably asking like, how does she not know what these look like? And because with lip glosses I've found, when you go on their website, their pictures can look like one thing. But one, I am a dark skin color compared to these colors. So they're not gonna look the same as they would look on lighter skin tones uh, than they would on dark skin tones. And I think that's why I like the darker lip glosses 
because they look better on darker skin tone where if light lip glosses you don't really look like I would never wear a light pink it won't look cute I've tried trust me several times it will not look cute the only I honestly stay away from pink colors to be honest the only pink colors I really wear if they're like a dark fuchsia like it may have to be like super dark fuchsia um moving on so this one is called Rocket Man, and this is literally this. This is purple. Like, I mean, there is no if and or but. This is a dark purple. Like, y'all see that? This is a dark purple, and I'm loving it. So I did really good with the lip glosses. There's only two that I'm questionable about, um, and I'll see those during the swatches to see if they are good to go. But uh, yeah, it was just a quick video you guys I just wanted to show you what all was in my ColourPop box and what I ordered my next video like I said will probably be the swatch test um depending on how long it is I might split that up into a couple of videos and the only reason I say that is because I do not want to sit here and edit a 50 minute video I'm just I'm gonna be completely honest with y'all I don't want to I've done that once and it took forever it took me three days because I just I didn't do it all in one setting. So if I can just split them up into smaller videos, I'm gonna try and do that for you guys. Um, unless you guys want them in bigger videos. But by the time you guys will see this video, I probably would have already recorded it. So it's okay. Um, but I might do like a video for the eyeshadows, a video for the lip glosses, a video for the, the mascara and eyeliner I probably will do together because I can do them together. Um, and the lipstick and lip glosses I probably will do together. So it might just be, hmm, and I might be able to do the eyeshadows with the lip glosses and with, maybe with the lip liner, eyeliner, with the eyeliner and mascara. So it might just be two videos, you guys. It might be two swatch videos and then a video where I just do a full face of color pop. I think I might do that. I'm so glad that we had this talk. It was a great talk. I really appreciate you guys. It's feedback, you know? You guys really keep me in the loop. I really appreciate it. Alright, let me stop playing with y'all. Let me go to bed. Um, but, yes, you guys. I'm going to be updating my videos more and more now. Um, after the color pop video, I did order some other things that I'm going to be doing a review on. So um, that's probably going to be coming up. I'm probably going to try and space them out so that you guys don't get a bunch of videos all at one time. Because I want you guys to be able to watch my videos and enjoy them. And not feel like you are overpowered by a bunch of videos. So I'll probably review, I'll probably do one video, post it, you know, and still like record them all. And then all I got to do is just edit them and post them. That would be a lot easier for me. But um, yeah, you guys. So you guys have a great day night and a great day with whatever time you guys watch this video and I will check back with you guys later don't forget to like comment and subscribe to this YouTube channel if you guys like to follow me on any of my other social medias I will have them somewhere in the corners of this video um, and I will also have the link to the ColourPop website so that you guys can make sure if you guys like anything you see, you guys can go ahead and click on there. And don't forget about that after pay. You know, you guys don't have to, like again, I just said, I didn't pay $300 off of this. I did a payment plan for this. Um, so do not think that, oh my gosh, she paid $300 for that. No, I didn't. I did not pay $300 for this. I, all this is worth $300. I'm just on a payment plan. So you gotta work smarter, not harder, you guys, all right? Guys, take it out there. Love you. Bye.